Ooga Chaka, Ooga Chaka, Ooga, Ooga, Ooga Chaka. All right. Welcome to the prehistoric past of Chrono Trigger. I'm Cross Knights, and I'm going to talk to this kind of kind of saber-looking guy. You outsiders, but why saber give party? Why? Hmm. I said that wrong. Regardless, now I'm I'm having like a. I had a little moral dilemma, like, what do I name her? Do I name her Saber, or do I keep her as Ayla? And I named her Saber because, one, the coin told me to. Which is really the biggest factor. But also because, you know, I had Saber firmed, uh, planted pretty firm in my head. But for some reason, I keep on almost saying Ayla. So somehow, despite the fact that I've never named her Ayla, I've always changed it. I have her as Ayla. I blame the Earth's Children books, damn it. Come on, Chrono, let's party. You drunk. This is no time to celebrate. Ah, oh, poor Robo. Hey, he's still kind of dancing-ish. Oh, well. I should have brought Luca. She wouldn't have been such a buzzkill. Ooga booga, mooga pooga. Dance with wind people. Good music. Passed down many generations. Back when you guys were just monkeys. Chrono, you try? Special Jurassic Pork Souk. Good stuff. Saber fight reptites. Their leader, Azriel. Very smart. All in Ioka village fight. No fight? Go to Larubu village. Don't know what village is. Always hide. Azriel wants to destroy Ioka and Larubu. Saber no lose. Only when Saber dead, give up. Enough. Meet Chrono today. Good day. Eat, party, sing, dance. I like your style. This is fantastic. I want to dance too. <laughs> hey, that's pretty good dancing. Yeah, I definitely should have brought Luca. But I used her too much. Robo was not enjoying this. He couldn't be more out of time. What an unpleasant substance. And so many bugs in it. I didn't know that he ate. That's kind of cool. Chrono, you look for red rock? Rare red rock, sign of power. Saber strongest in Ioka. So Saber's rock. You want? You challenge Saber. You win, then Saber give you. God, I'm gonna have to fist fight her. But whatever. If I have to punch a blonde woman in the face, I'll punch a blonde woman in the face. Bring plenty soup. Oh, it's an eating contest. Party now, so eat. Chrono and Saber have soup race. Thought we were gonna fight in uncombed combat, and she was gonna throw me to another time period. Oh, jeez, it's a soda guzzling contest all over again. Now we start. <laughs> Press A button much times. You know, it's still uh, breaking the fourth wall even if you try to integrate it. <laughs> Little did you know, I was the soup guzzling champion. It's only soda that gives me problems because of the carbonation. But there's no carbonation in this. Only bugs. Enough, Chrono. You win. I give you rock. Chrono, eat plenty. Eat last bowl of soup for health, but I just ate like 15 bowls. Okay, eat! Twist in my arm. Maybe eat too much. Huh. Chrono, we were expecting you to be the designated driver. Good, good morning. That soup seems to affect humans. And robots. I didn't even know that you slept. Good morning, Chrono. Wasn't that fun last night? <laughs> Chrono thinks it was not. What... What made these footprints? It, it's gone! Oh no, the gate key is gone! What? Whomever left those prints took the gate key. It's too risky to use the gate without it. 
Chrono. We have to find Saber. It's always something. Wake the hell up! Kick. Huh? Chrono? You wake already? Oh. Too much soup. Sleep like stone! <coughs> We'd let you sleep, but a valuable item has been stolen. W what? Must be reptites! Chrono, come with Sabo. We settle with reptites. Who else come? Um. Hmm. Do I want. Yeah, yeah let's take. Let's take under. Someone from out. Someone from Village C. We go ask. Come, Chrono. Yeah, new character. Also, if you uh, hit run, she runs awesome. That's why we name her Saber. She doesn't actually have a tail. It's part of her outfit. It's it's hard to tell. But yeah. Kind of looks like she has a tail, though, doesn't it? Have I even saved since I got here? No, I haven't. Well. Footsteps follow. Let us check out our new companion. Note her weapon is Fist. You cannot equip any weapons on her. She is an unarmed fighter. She's the only character where you don't equip weapons on her. I mean, Robo looks like he's using his, uh... He looks like he's unarmed, but... If you notice, uh, the fists actually pop out of his arm sockets. So he actually does use a weapon, and he can equip different fists. She just punches people. She doesn't need weapons, though. <laughs> Notice her attack power is actually considerably higher than Robo's. So she has superhuman strength. She could probably arm wrestle Robo. Robo's actually the character that I've named different names the most. I know I've named him Bit before. I've named him, uh... I've named him Data after the Star Trek, which is actually a pretty good name, I think. This is the first time I've named him Ender, though. Find Petal, Fang, Horn, and Feather at Hunting Range. When rain, rare monster come. Trading house. Now they don't actually use money here. Um, they use items that you can get off of monsters. You'll notice that I haven't gotten any money here. It's all just uh, these items, and you can trade them for weapons. So let me see what I have. Hmm. Yeah, I don't have enough. I think I'm gonna have to go to the hunting range. Trade your shiny stones? Oh, they do use money here. Okay. They just don't use it for the important stuff. Whatever. Fine. <laughs> I'm loaded. Thunder stunned all dinosaur. You know that? No, I don't know that, because thunder is sound, Missy. Lightning is the actual strike. No one has been struck by thunder. Alright, let's see... The hunting range is up here. Dactyl nest? That's not the hunting range. That's the hunting range. Let's go try our new friend out. Three frogs! Uh, what do you got? Oh, you don't have any special techniques left. Maximum Cyclone. Well, I'm really surprised that it hit that last one. Maximum Cyclone is a really great move. Plus, it looks hilarious. Ender just grabs Chrono's feet, feet and starts spinning, and he holds the sword out. And Saber actually has some pretty cool, um... Pretty cool dual techs. Slash! Wham. And she gets back by rolling. Oh yeah, you see Robo's, uh, you see Ender's arm? <laughs> he puts his arm out, uh, there's nothing there, and then the fist pops out of his arm and punches him. It's kind of like if you've ever seen Big O. It's like a quick version of that punch. 
Big O's weird as hell, though. I don't know if I can recommend it. I've never actually seen all of it. I was gonna watch all of it, but then someone spoiled the ending for me and I lost interest. <laughs> Love it. Now, if you remember an episode or two ago, I fought something called a new. It's this weird blue creature. When it rains, a new will appear. Uh, it appears randomly, so you have to run around and look for it. All their monsters disappear when it's raining. If you fight it, though, you can get a crap load of uh, all the items for trading. I'm not seeing it. Nope. You have to be a little bit lucky and know all the hiding spots and run to them as fast as possible. Let's see. Not spend yet. We actually want something that does multiple hits. I'm gonna need to go and get her some uh, some tech points so she has something. Though I believe, if I remember right, her first technique is actually a healing one called Kiss. So that's not all that useful. Let's see, tech points. Yep. Oh, that also restores your status. That's actually pretty cool. I don't think Aura or Slurp do that. Cure Beam might, but I can't say for sure. Eventually you're gonna run out of monsters, but you can always just leave and come back. Okay, I'm going to, uh... cut it out until I get my next, uh, rainstorm. There's the rain. Come on, where are you, blue guy? I know you're here somewhere. Oh, that was a rock. <laughs> I thought I saw him with my peripheral vision, but it was a rock. Ah! Ah! Damn it! Did that count? Yes! You strong. Oh my god! That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> what? Oh, third eye. Okay. That is not supposed to happen. You're supposed to fight him. But I guess since he was leaving, he just gave it to me. That has never happened to me before. And again, I've played this game a lot, and that has never happened to me before. That was awesome. <laughs> so there's a little trick for you. See if it see if someone if someone can replicate it and tell me if that actually works for them. Just find him and then don't go to him until the last second. That would be awesome. But a uh, third eye increases evade times two. Now, most characters don't have very high evade. Um, Saber, very high evade. You put it on her. It's going to be pretty hard for people to hit them with special attacks. And I believe the evade stat is actually a percentile thing, but I could be wrong, which means, if I'm right, that means she has a 50% chance of evading physical attacks, which is amazing. Worth the, uh, decrease in power. And I'm actually going to give... Yeah, I'll give it to Robo. Ender. Damn it, I keep on doing that. I can't help it, he's a robot. Makes me think Robo. And not Ender. Still, as far as, uh... Like you saw in the factory, his purpose was, like, exterminating humans. So the name Ender kind of, uh... Kind of fits. He, like, ends people's lives. Alright, I definitely have enough. Alright, so let me see. Pedal... What if I do the same? Is that... No, same no good. Okay. So we'll do... Two pedal. Two fangs. Hopefully that's the sword. Ruby gun. No thanks, I'm not using Luca. Uh, Alright. Pedal. And horn. Sage bow. I'm not using Mar. Damn it! Alright. <laughs> no, screw you. Where's the guy that tells me things? Is it you? Yes, alright. So I want Petal and Feather, Fang and Horn, and then we'll get some vests and stuff. Alright. So, uh, I've forgotten already. 
I'm gonna cut my attempts out. <laughs> I'm gonna cut out my shopping attempts if I screw this up. Okay, that's the stone arm. So the next one must be... Fang and Horn. There we go. Those are the two weapons I wanted. Next we want... Horn... and Feather. Alright, I bought two rock helmets. I just cut out the second one, because... blah. That's pretty good right there. I could get a ruby vest. I probably should, but... Yeah, I'm gonna get one ruby vest. Give me a second. Unless, um... Unless I don't have enough petals for it, and then screw it, I'm just gonna go. I haven't died yet, I don't need anything. Fang and feather? Yeah, I don't I don't think I have that. But I'm I'm I guess I'm not gonna be doing uh I'm not probably not gonna be doing this mission this episode. I'll probably walk there. Yeah, I need one more feather. Alright, so let's walk down to the canopy over here. To the forest maze. Kino, what you do? Say now! Saber. Kino takes Grono's stuff. Treason! Kill him! Why take? Kino likes Saber best. Saber like Chrono, but Kino not like. Miss Saber, please do not promote violence. Kino, you know why I punish? Saber no like Kino. No! Saber like Kino best! But no more do bad stuff, okay? That wrong! Saber. Sorry, Saber. Sorry, Chrono. Give back stuff to Chrono. No have. Reptites take. Reptites? Where they go? One into trees. There! Saber go to Kino go back to village. Kino protect village while Saber not there. Okay, Saber. Yeah, get the hell out of here, you damn thief. Kino was man. You Saber die. Kino chief, then. Saber. You are gentle at heart. Chase, reptites. Get Chrono stuff back. Let me check the time to see if Chrono can get stuff back. Chrono time too much. 18 minutes exceeded has. Stop, I must. Wait, I'm doing Yoda, not a cave woman. Oh, well. I'm not good at cave woman. I see next time. We go fight reptites. Googa, ooga, ooga, chaka.